What's up guys, my name is Potato, bringing you another server Saturday, and it I'm just, I am on top of the world right now. I had a great birthday yesterday, I had plenty of sleep, I woke up, I feel fantastic, and the, the it's just, it's amazing to me, you know. I, I like being able to go out drinking with my friends, wake up and feel great the next day. Um, for those of you who are of age, you know the, um, <clears throat> how terrible it could be you know waking up from a night of drinking and just having the worst hangover and just being gross and sick and ugh, hate it okay so anyways we're gonna start off with omni's new place uh i featured his last house right over there the one with the uh automatic reed farming thing and his lighthouse over there <clears throat> he decided to bump it up a notch and do a little uh boarding house type deal or rental something i i don't know what to Explain it. It says Omni Priest's house, but uh, you you guys will see. So we're gonna close those doors. And as you can see in here, it's not just a giant blob of wood. It's an actual building, I guess. I don't I don't know how to how to explain it. It's um basically like a hotel type s dealy. Um, I assume Japanese themed in some sorts. Has a very nice little uh. A garden little courtyard thing here with some benches some trees and um, it is multi-floor he is still working on it um, every time I come on I, I, I'm pretty sure he just comes over here and just spends his entire time working at, I guess finishing this up apparently these floors right here are the common rooms where um, there's enough uh, rooms in here to to house everybody on the server uh, third floor uh, is moderators <clears throat> the moderators will have their own rooms and the fourth floor will be for admins so uh, I believe sniper goo actually has reserved this room over here because he wanted a room that faced the sunset I guess um, but as you can see these rooms are still very very empty um, but like I said, I, I really like this. He he went off and did this by himself without telling anybody until it got to... Well, the last time I was here, this, this third floor wasn't here yet. Um, and you guys can see the dirt actually up up there. I think he's marking out where the fourth, uh, fourth story is going to be, which apparently is going to, um, if I remember right, close this little gap. Like, it's not going to be open to the sky. I think he said it's going to be um, a roof. The fourth floor will act as the roof. I don't, I don't know. Um, I kind of like the open feel of it. So if he is going to make it a roof, maybe <clears throat> maybe he'll only bring it in a little bit. I don't know. It's his project, so I'm, I'm really excited to see how he's going to finish it. Um, the fact that he did all of this by himself is uh, pretty impressive to me. Um, if he did have any help, I'm, I'm not aware of it. So... Sorry if I haven't given anybody uh, credit that they deserve. Uh, another little feature here is that there's a mine whoop, underneath the fountain here. And uh, this this goes down all the way to bedrock. And I um, thought that was kind of cool. You know, hide the mine underneath the, mi or the, the fountain here. It's a cool, cool little feature. So, um... Yeah, there's not much else to show about this place. Uh, just really awesome looking. So definitely wanted to show that on this server Saturday. Um, <clears throat> let's actually move to the church. Okay, and this is the church that um, I believe it was Kearney. Kearney? You got to tell me how you're... Is there... Oh, shoot. I didn't even see. Oh, there he is. He's right there. Dressed up in his priest outfit. Um... He made this church, and I, I like it. It's uh, it's definitely something that we hadn't had on the server yet. Uh, we've had a few people, or I think we've had one other person who made a smaller one, but I don't even think it's there anymore. Um, let's see. Church builders and helpers. Builders, Divination, Clark, Zoom Josh, Holy Me. Oh yeah, I did help a little bit. Um, and Q. Uh, and we call him Q instead of Cats are Cocks, because Cats are Cocks. Um, <laughs> okay, I get it. Little Bibles there on the corners. It's pretty cool. 
Um, I think that is still so he can work on it, maybe? I don't know if that's construction or if uh, it's a church thing, because I, I, I'm not religious, so I, I wouldn't know what these giant churches really involve. I just know that they're pretty awesome. Um, there he is right there, where they would stay and probably preach to, uh, to the people, you know, say, don't do bad things, and if you do bad things, bad things will happen to you. Some, I don't know, some church talk. And I think this is where they, uh, baptize people? Uh, holy water, maybe? I don't know. Um, priest quarters. I have a feeling that, oh, no, nope. he's not. Okay. <laughs> Didn't know if he was, like, leading me places or not. Uh, priest quarters. Hopefully this is done. Last time I was here, it wasn't done yet. It definitely looks done. What's in here? Showers? Bathroom? That looks like a toilet. Hmm. Got a kitchen type deal here. Nice little fireplace. I like how he wrapped it around the corner here. That's neat. We got some really, really creativity, yeah, creative members on the server. Um, I like that a lot. Got some beds here. Uh, bonsai tree? <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm sure he doesn't, that's not going to grow, so I think that's what he's trying to go for, is just like a little plant. Um, I didn't even, was this cake here before? I think it was. Um, let me see if I can't think of any other parts that are in here. I know there's this one um, little like sign deal here. Sister Anna's resting place. Oh, okay. Well, go go her for resting for years. I don't I don't know. I don't know who Sister Anna is. Uh, looks like there's a basement or something over here. Is there one here? Nope. I'm gonna walk on down over here. Do, do, do. Grave Saint of Lucas. Grave robbery. Oh no. And it's on fire? Shit. Seems like a job for the Mongoose PD. Panic room. Light switch. Oh. Uh -huh. This side doesn't work though. I like the uh like the initiative. I'm gonna turn those back on. Close the doors. <clears throat> and I guess this is where they do emergency prayers. Oh, I hear a zombie across, over there on the other side of that wall. That's cool. I like it. I like it. I like people who build um, <clears throat> giant things like this, like big structures and stuff, but they don't just stop at the normal structure. They, um... Oh, that's cool. A little, uh... Exit out of there. Um, they add, like, an extra little, uh... Like a basement type deal like that, you know, the panic room, everything. They, they don't just stop at the main building. They, they add little features that you won't see unless you're, you're, um, you spend a little bit of time walking around. Um, I think that's it. I'm not sure. I don't necessarily know what's going on right there. But I know that's been there for a while. I remember seeing it. <clears throat> this house right here, which I believe, uh, uh, Kern actually built himself as well. Or it could have been Yeruza, because I know he has like a little like hidey hole type deal here. And just slowly trek through the water. Yeah. There we go. Oh, back in the water. This um I like this pathway that they're they've been building here. Uh I believe it goes underwater and back into town somewhere. Um let me try to get a side view of it here. I like this house. It's um uh I don't know how to how to put it. It's original, I guess. Um you know, it's it's not it doesn't follow by the the typical rules of the way people build houses, which I 
again, I, I really like, you know, I like people trying out new things and, and see like who would do this, who would build, um, blocks out of the half stones and make a double stone across there and, and make it look like there's, I guess, um, utensils. I don't think that's actually supposed to be a workbench, but rather the utensils here. Um, I'm not sure. Don't forget to wash your hands. Wash my butt. There we go. And uh, dining room. All right. I like dining rooms. Mm, what is... Uh, we'll, we'll go check out the upstairs real quick. Looks like this is just one big bedroom. One man living in a giant house. I like that a lot, too. That's a nice skylight. Ah, and he carried, carried the theme over to these, too. Cool. Uh, what is this? Storage room? Bunch of chests. Okay. Bathroom. All right. Don't forget to wash your hands again. Yeah. Toilet and uh, fancy bathtub? Maybe? I'm, I'm going to go with fancy bathtub. Um... Let's see, we got a, a wizard thing or something over there. Uh, perhaps Gandalf's brother? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Okay, and now we'll go outside to the backyard. Where's this giant pool? And I think this is a spa. It's an interesting idea with a, um, a fall off into the pool, which I've actually seen in, in real pools, so that's a very nice little touch here. I mean, it's it's the placement's weird because you wouldn't think that you'd like to see a big church, you know, right next to a really nice house like this, but um, kind of looks like a face, doesn't it? Eyes, like a mustache and a mouth. It's like throwing up into the pool. Okay, anyways. Back to not being distracted. I don't know what this is, or if it's just supposed to be like a bonfire dealie, but um, I don't know. I like it. You know, I don't hate it. It's built nice. It's it has symmetry. It's I like it. That's all I can say. Um, there's a hole down here. Where does this go? Is this where they're gonna play soccer? Oh, it's a farm. Only one one row of, of seeds, it looks like. Perhaps he's still working on it. Um, I don't know what this hole will be. Maybe it was a cave? Um, it was all underwater. Didn't even see it. Maybe it's just going to be a giant farm or something? I don't know. Maybe he's trying to get uh, cows and stuff to spawn down here? I don't know. Do not know. Hmm. Hit it pretty well. I didn't even see that. Okay, well, that's about it for this server Saturday. I've been kind of sticking to three structures per video. Um, try not to go make these too long. That way, each Saturday, you guys have something to, to look for. You know, see a few nice looking houses. Maybe get some ideas for your own. Um, on Monday during my Machinarium video, I will be talking more about the competition that I have coming up for the, um, for the, uh, I, I don't know, for a spot on the server and, um, I'm still thinking I'm going to give out a signed t-shirt. So, um, anyways, I'll talk to you guys more about that on Monday and, um, if you haven't already, go register on the forums, be part of the community if you have Rift. We're accepting every member that wants to be a part of it. Um, so just go on the forums, check out our PC gaming section, and you'll see uh, all the info you need for um, our Rift Guild and everything. So, see you guys.